First, it was guns and drugs. Now, a frightening story of violence in the Orleans Parish prison that has nearly taken the life of a minor offender. Brendan McCarthy brings us an update on his shocking investigative report. And the class action lawsuit surrounding conditions at the jail, where that stands and what prison reform groups say about their battles with the sheriff's office and city hall. Plus, actress Diane Ladd steps down from the big screen to take a turn as a novelist. She'll talk with us about her new book. It's the 504 on My 54, covering the biggest issues and events all over Southeast Louisiana. Now, here's Melanie Bear. You might recognize her from the big screen or from TV, and now you'll see her book on store shelves, A Bad Afternoon for a Piece of Cake. She is a three-time Oscar nominee and British Academy Award winner, and she does it all. She's a director. I think she's probably a producer. She's a writer. Everything. Miss Diane Ladd is joining us. You are a director now. Yeah, well. And, um, and a novelist. Well, I directed a film called Mrs. Monk that won three Best Director Awards in Europe. Fantastic. And I'm the first woman in history to direct her ex-husband. So Love my it. motto is, ladies, if you want revenge, direct your ex-husband. No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> He's a great I love actor. It. So tell us about your new book. My new book is a collection of short stories, Melanie. And psychiatrists say that if you're stressed out, which most of us are today, mm -hmm. that if you get 50 miles away from where you live, it can change your whole energy. And it's healing. Or you can have a glass of red wine at night. Or you can read a short story, for true, that reading a short story, first of all, you feel you won because you end. It's not like you have to wait for the novel over and over again for the ending to come. And so you can do it while you're waiting for a meeting, or if you're mad at somebody, take a break. Go read a short story. It just changes and refreshes like a shower, the energy. So this, this book... A bad afternoon for a piece of cake. I like the way you said that. A bad you, afternoon. Yeah, men particularly like this story. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a diet book, I promise you. Uh, you can get the book on Amazon. You can get the book in Barnes & Noble. Or you can go to my website, dianelad.com, and there's a link. And, of course, a lot of people know you from Alice, the TV, the hit TV show, which started off as a movie. Alice doesn't live here anymore. Uh, the film was my first Oscar nomination. I lost the Oscar to the great Ingrid Bergman, but I uh, won it over her in the mother country. I won the British Academy Award. Oh, congrats. Yeah, yeah, what an then accomplishment. The second no, Oscar like... nomination was Rambling Rose that I started in with my daughter, Laura Dern. And we can presently be seen on uh, HBO's Enlightened. The Enlightened, yeah. It's on demand. And um, Ram and Laura, your daughter, was yeah. uh, star of Jurassic Park. And uh, yeah, so she's uh, they're re-releasing that in 3D right now. Yeah, and yeah, she's yeah. actually here in New Orleans making a film. And um, we, the film Ramblin' Rose, was chosen by Princess Diana as her favorite movie of all time. Princess Diana honor. had a party in her honor, a royal premiere, flew us to London and a really? party, and I got to sit next to her while she's watching me act, which was really <laughs> unnerving. I kept trying to peek at her to see what she thought, you know, <laughs> but it was a great experience. Not bad for a girl from Mississippi whose daddy sold medicine for chickens. How about that? Yeah, Meridian, Mississippi. Meridian, it's Mississippi, hear, and yeah, I lived in South. Laurel and Poplarville. I got real, my real name was Lanier, Ladnier or Ladner, and Tennessee Williams was my cousin. And this review from this book tells, um, tells it all, I guess, because it, it compares me to all the Southern writers, including Tennessee Williams. I can live off this review the best of my life. And, uh, That's and I ask fantastic. And you have not been to New Orleans for the Stella competition yet, and you're related yet, to Tennessee no. Williams. I did get here to be Empress of the August Group Parade. And for all of you who saw the film Argo, which is great, so is Lincoln, so is Flight, but they got some good films, so is uh, Silver Lining Playbook. Oh, yeah. But the, the hostages of Iran, 16 of them that were held 444 days, were my guest here in New Orleans, invited by the city of New Orleans. In Mattery. In, in, in Mattery, I was August Argus. crew, but the party was here in New Orleans. 3,000 people attended, and I got to meet all those people who were hostages and... Uh, I got an earful. Well, so what a story. all these things inspired me to write this book to share with people. I give you the gift of entertainment, not just in acting, <laughs> but in writing. You can carry it around with you. You don't have to talk to anybody. You Ms. can just Lad. judge it yourself. Thanks so much for being here. Bad God bless afternoon you. for a piece of cake. Check it out on Amazon.